We usually get to the job site, go to the car, get our graphics out, lay them out where we want, wipe the car down with the denatured alcohol, make sure all the dust and things like that are off. After we unroll the wrap, we usually wrap in two-man teams. And some of the parts are two-man jobs, some of them are one-man jobs. So we'll start on the roof, and after we do the roof as a two-man team, one person will take the hood and they'll attack the hood wrap, while another person will go to the rear and wrap the deck lid and the rear panel. Uh, get finished about the same time, and then we'll both start on uh, helping each other, what we call hang the sides on the car, which is nothing more than getting the car, getting the vinyl put onto the side of the car. Then basically, uh, once we start doing that, we'll cut the windows out, what we call detailing, cut around uh, the filler neck, the gas filler neck. Once we get so far along, then we'll start putting all the other extra decals on, whether it be the numbers or uh, the quarter panel decals, just whatever the customer orders. Sometimes, because of the industry, uh, some teams don't know who their sponsors are going to be from one day to the next, and so uh, we may end up printing a wrap one morning and installing it that afternoon. When you do that, it's, it's just a little bit more work and most people wouldn't realize it, but our really busy season begins when the race season is over. Uh, what with driver changes, sponsor changes, things like that. Sponsors are real particular about, we bought this space on the car, we want this decal here. So our biggest thing is to get it to match the layout, because the layout is final. And if we have any questions, we always consult the team, because they're the biggest ones on the sponsorship issues and it is finished.